Congrats on getting your Blast Box. You're about three minutes from reaching listeners with the press of a button. The first step to streaming on Blast Radio is to create a profile in the free Blast Radio mobile app. If you haven't done that, go ahead and hit pause, download the app, and set up your profile. Let's first get oriented with Blast Box. On the back of the device is an RCA input. This is how you connect the audio source you want to stream. It could be a turntable, a controller, a home stereo setup, a modular synth, the mixer, or even a cassette player. As long as you connect it with an RCA cable, you can stream it. On the front of the device is a headphone input. This is how you can monitor the sound coming into your blast box to make sure it isn't too quiet or loud. The knob on top of the device can be used to adjust your headphone volume. Note, this doesn't have any impact on the volume of your actual stream. Okay, let's go ahead and pair your device to your account. First, turn on the device by pressing the red button. When it powers on, you'll see the current firmware on the device, and then it will say Setup Mode. Take out your phone and open the Blast Radio app. Tap the stream icon on the top right, and then tap Setup Device. Select your device, then your Wi-Fi network. The device will then reset and say Ready. You can press the gray button on top of the device to see your current battery level, your Wi-Fi strength, and your username. Now you're ready to stream. Let's get your sound right. To test your sound, let's do a sound check, which is a private stream that only you can hear. Open the Blast Radio app, tap the streaming icon on the top right, then tap the sound check text. Press the red button to start your stream. Hit play on whatever audio source you're planning to share with listeners. Open the app and you should see your profile picture in the top left corner with a yellow circle around it. Tap on that picture to listen to the audio coming through. If you're happy with the sound, then you're ready to start streaming for listeners. Soundcheck turns off automatically after you do one stream. So now, all you need to do is press the red button to stop your soundcheck, and the next time you press it again, you'll be live for listeners. We suggest doing a soundcheck every time you join a new Wi-Fi network to ensure your connection is strong enough for a quality stream. If you're not happy with the quality of your stream, for instance, if it sounds glitchy or if it has drops in the audio, that's almost certainly an internet connection issue. All streams are uploaded to the cloud in a lossless wave format, so a good connection is essential to sounding good. Try moving closer to your Wi-Fi source or turning off other devices that could be consuming a lot of bandwidth, such as streaming video players. Now you're ready to start streaming. Host a full-on radio show, do a DJ set, Play your favorite tunes, get experimental, shows can be as long or as short as you want. Have fun. Happy streaming.